100. If you had it that bad, an ass whooping's never that bad. Mm. Never, ever, ever. If you had it that bad, an ass whooping's never. So anytime you see a fighter try to talk about where he came from, it was so difficult and all this stuff. And then as soon as he gets tough, he's looking for he's looking at the first window to jump out of, like Connor and certain other people. And you start to question how bad did he really have it. Did he, did he even have the skills of a pro boxer, or no. was he just like somebody come off the street and? No, he, he literally just tried to do his karate in the in the ring. I mean, it was basically like he tried to do his karate without kicks. That's basically what it was. <clears throat> was it bizarre kind of face that? Yeah, I remember the first time he I came out to spar him. He came out and this was his stance, no joke. <laughs> <laughs> the boxing goes on. He got out like he, he gave me one of these. And I was like, what the fuck is this guy doing? <laughs> Did you have to hold him in the light? I was like, I, I was like, is he gonna try to take me down? You know, I was like, what's this guy doing right now? You know, so, so I mean, I don't know, he, he can't spell fight, bro. Come on, I, I mean, listen, he, he's pretty good in the, in the octagon, but it's only until you press him, even in the octagon. When you have no balls, you have no balls in all facets of your life. It's not just mm. in the ring. If you have no balls, you have no balls. You know what I mean? Then I just, that's gonna have balls in the octagon, but you're not gonna have them in the ring. No, it doesn't work that way. It's just to get him to a point of suffering in the octagon, he has some skills. So you gotta get, you gotta push him there. It takes a little more to push him there. In the boxing ring where he sucks, you know, it's not that difficult to get him to the point where he's gotta show some character and he'll, he'll, never, he'll never have it. Does, does it bother you that somebody that doesn't have that talent and doesn't have balls like you say is getting paid the way he is and a real no. fighter like yourself or other real fighters no, out no, there? No, 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 I, I never count on people's money. All right. I, I, and, I, and that's never what bothered me, you know? Um, you know, it's all about business, and, uh, and I understand money doesn't grow on trees, and if it generates money, then people are going to get paid. That never bothered me, because I, I live fine. Listen, if I was maybe dirt poor in the street mm -hmm. or something like that, and I'm like, man, I need to, I wish they could have gave me that chance. Dude, I, I have millions. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm worth millions in terms of assets and money. Dude, I'm, I'm fine. You know what I'm saying? So, so I, I, I'm never going to go just try to try to look at somebody else and what they have and, and say, oh man, I deserve that. I, I, I don't care about that. You know, as long as I'm paying my bills, because at one time in my life, I really couldn't pay my bills. I'm not kind of regretting status. Like literally like <laughs> I had to go in from house to house. Yeah. You know what I mean? So okay. like then, then when you have all of a sudden you're paying your bills and you're paying your bills comfortably, you're happy. You know what I mean? You, 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 you live a comfortable good life, you're happy. So I, I would never like care about what, what somebody else's money ha is or what they got in their bank account or what they get paid. Just, I was always about getting mine, and this was this is obviously about getting more than getting mine. This was obviously about just, you know, um, being a man about what you said you did. So, I told you to look after his intentions when I saw you on Long Island. Yes. And yes. I was suspicious about that from the jump. Yeah, but I, I mean, even I couldn't have pictured that. You know what I mean? Like, well, I thought what the, was the worst is going to happen. He's not going to like me. He's going to try to fight, make it a fight. Like, I love all these MMA fans, so you should have known it was going to be a fight. <laughs> but you know the sparring we do? The, the sparring we do in gyms that wasn't even like one of the top thousand difficult sparrings I've had in my life. Old school decent, right? Yeah, dude. I mean, that was like that was like a, a different level of of, uh, of of sparring in those days, man. Uh, even the wild card days when I was a wild card, bro. This guy would have get eaten alive. You put him in one of those gyms. Are you kidding me? Hey, this guy sucks.